So today, <laughs> I have the shameless Maya! Hello. Let me tell you something, guys. Like, you guys always, like, commend me for my confidence and stuff. And I want to say thank you to Maya Hello. for giving. Like, I've been watching her for so, so long. And, she, like, you guys see that I wear makeup outside, not just at home. All the time. This is where I get my confidence from, it's from her. And she's just so amazing and so talented at everything from photography, production, and acting. And I love her. You guys should check her out on her channel. She's amazing. Oh, thank you. Like this is honestly so surreal. Man. No, thank you so much. So today I did a full beat on her and she's like, I always do a beat makeup and it doesn't ever I never go dramatic. I I, I never can. But I love this and I hope you guys love it too and I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial. Hey guys, it's Patrick Star and Maya and she is going to get a beat face and we are starting off with a Studio Fix Fluid in the colors NC45 and NC50 and then we are going to conceal the face and lay on that concealer hunty and we are using Pro Long Wear Concealer yeah she's ready for a beat down come through concealer and I'm using the colors NC30 and NW25 and I'm gonna take my booty blender and I'm going to bounce the booty side up and down all over her face and then further blend with a brush and then next I'm going to take the Laura Mercier translucent setting powder and I'm only going to set this under the eyes and cook this concealer I'm not going to use this on the rest of the face because I want to set the rest of the face using this the mineralized skin finish powder by MAC and it is in the color medium dark this powder is flawless and it's sickening and it's the best and for brows I wanted to use the brow wiz by Anastasia Beverly Hills in the color granite and I'm going to make her brows fuller her brows are a lot more short from left to right and I wanted to give her a thicker fuller more arched brow and I'm going to take texture and soft brown by MAC and I'm going to run this in the crease of her eye with an E40 brush by Sigma. The E40 brush and the E25 brush are the best brushes to have because they execute the eye really really well. And this brush right here is the Sigma E25 brush and I'm using Red Earth and Beauty Mark by Anastasia, her eyeshadows. And I'm going to sketch that in the outer corner crease of the eye, leaving the lid open. And you can get a discount, 10% off Sigma, using the code PSTAR. Um, next, I'm going to mix some highlight colors, and I wanted to go for some shimmer. And I'm going to pat this all over the lid of the eye for a nice, bright, sexy, but sultry eye. Next, I'm taking my Shu Yumura Lash Curler. It is the best lash curler ever. And I'm going to take Ardell eyelashes. These are the double pack in the wispy style. And I'm going to apply some duo and we're gonna stack on lashes. So for lashes, I used one pair, applied it, and then I applied a second pair. And then towards the outer part of her eyes, I stacked individual lashes one by one in different lengths, medium and long, to create a very flirty, sexy, and shameless effect. Next, I'm going to take the Extended Play Mascara and run this along her lashes to give it a sexy look. And then I'm going to take the same Anastasia color, Beauty Mark, and I'm going to take this on a Morphe flat angled brush. And I'm going to sketch this right under the eye to create a beautiful smoky effect. I'm mixing Red Earth and Beauty Mark. And then next, I'm going to take the Inglot Black Eye Coal and I'm going to run this in her waterline and smudge it out. 
So now that the bottom of the lash line is done, I'm going to take this Pro Finish Powder by Makeup Forever in the color 128 and highlight her face. And then I'm going to take NW50 Studio Fix Foundation. I love contouring with foundations. And I'm going to bronze her. You see how, how bronze she looks? Next, I'm going to take Lovejoy Blush and blush her the hell up because she is a beautiful. And I'm going to add a little bit of gold deposit along her face. You see that shine on her cheekbone? Yes! Come through, Maya! Okay, for lips, I wanted to give her some DSL, some dainty, succulent lips, and we overlined the hell out of her lips. And I thought it was really sexy. I added Seduction Gloss by Gerard Cosmetics, and she was obsessed with me snatching her nose, so we're gonna snatch her nose, and we're gonna arch her brow a little bit closer to Jesus, and keep her fleek and sexy and this is the finished look i wanted something really glowy something beat not to drag something sexy flirty and most of all shameless and maya has been an inspiration to me you guys you have no idea she has taught me to do you stay true and be shameless check her out you guys we did an amazing drag trans Information on her channel. I gave her the ultimate beat down. This is it. Check it out on her channel. Please like this video, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys so, so much from the bottom of my heart, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.